great, he cut his hair. Great kissing and how to have a good kiss with the girl. Oh, well, now she's not going to want to kiss you. Now you have to pay her to kiss you. Shows her that Cut your hair, man. What are you doing? And that you have kissed and work up to neck kissing. Oh, we could do neck kissing too. Uh, <laughs> Please, no. No, no, no. I didn't get that. I didn't, yeah, I didn't get paid enough for that. No, no, no. Her with your hands. That, I will report that as a crime. Sexy, but I want you to remember going on. I get it. A kiss is important. Yes. You kind of feel the sexual tension. I actually think it's important to, after the first kiss, shake her. Give her something that'll shake her core a little bit. Like, say, hey, I'm actually only 14. And see how she responds. And how to actually if she responds kiss, negatively, I mean, she's not worth it. You know what I mean? She's clearly not in it for me. You know that the kiss nervous. Okay, if the first. Kiss Why is this guy stalling I mean, so hard? He's kiss never kissed a girl I, before. Like, tried to kiss her, and then like she kind of you either. How many bracelets is he wearing? Was that twenty bracelets? Or he kissed at an angle. Also, this is that I always like to kiss one for each kiss. Way. So if usually, um, right. you can go on the elbows or on the waist. And then put the put the fist out to the side for a fist bump from the frat bro that you asked to go to this party with. Make sure she's not going to be her face. You can have one hand, I guess, but it's much more romantic and movie If you have a chiropractic background, you give her a little neck adjustment. hands right here. Let's say you're talking and you're having a little bit. This is like some anime shit. There's going to be like little sparks flying. She's about to get it. So you put both hands on here. If you really want to be, if it's a really yes. romantic moment, you can very romantic. Your cheeks, and you can say, "Wow, you're so beautiful." Tell but her. Usually, tell her, not me, Hector. Kiss, tell her. Up, put your hands here. Fucking tell her. And then you can go straight on like this. <gasps> He's done it. And His soft. first kiss. And on you air. Make sure that you end the kiss yourself. They said it couldn't be done. Control. Because it's great. Kissing is great. <laughs> he's already uh, come, so he's stopped. you want to show that you're not too eager. He's done. Again, that you have experience. Yeah, you can go. You can go. And that you're the in control over. of it. And that she's the one go clean up. chasing. And lean on your side. Mm -hmm. and you That's you when you start to freestyle it, a little so bit. So she knows which side to lean to, so you don't smack. Get it with a 360 faces. kiss. And mm -hmm. so you lean to the side that you're going to be leaning on. Now watch. There's a detail here. <laughs> I'm on her bottom lip. <laughs> Obviously, because I'm shorter, this is going to be natural. But when you're in control of it, this is when you suck on her chin. Too, she's going to feel more feminine. Yeah. Because as a man, you're in control. Like we lead. What does so she think? Does she agree? Kissing the bottom. That doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what she thinks. Like that, and then. Oh yeah, just like that. You're opening up and closing. All right. I know this is. I think I've got detailed, it now. Twenty minutes. Fucking kiss, and I've heard from girls that a lot of guys don't know. How to Thomas Alva Edison no. This guy's much cooler than that Thomas Edison. For self -defense. Granted, my only exposure to Thomas Edison was Jimmy Neutron, but Meet this guy looks Yoshiro a lot cooler. Nakamatsu. Largest collection of Legend of Zelda memorabilia? Hey, our first female collector. Wow. Look at all that. Is that the whole my collection? Just no one collects Zelda, Zelda shit? I, thought it's so I bet I have something she doesn't have. Game, nope, I immediately just saw it. It's the Master Sword. Well played, I Anne. Well played. I actually, I have something she doesn't have. She wouldn't want. So just keep going. Oh, yeah. Hey, Anne. Your collection's not complete without one of these. Limited edition, uh... Uh, what the fuck is this brand called? I'm pretty sure it's just like a bootleg controller. Limited edition uh, bootleg Nintendo Switch uh, Zelda controller. Ten grand, and Ten grand, you can complete collection. I'll be expecting an email. Man, this place is looking like a fucking dope-ass club here. This is awesome. Why can't church be like that over here? <laughs> this looks fucking cool. <laughs> I'd go here just for the concert. Enter Japan's bizarre museum of rocks with faces. <laughs> yeah, you just zoom out and there's a rock that has my exact face on it. There it is. That's definitely a face right there. That was a face and a half. Was that a John Goodman rock? What is this? Almost primitive technology? Someone said go to the comments that has timestamps. The only timestamp I see is that wood was a bit creaky. How helpful. Oh, I see he shit his pants. 
Yo, the guy actually just fucking shit his pants. <laughs> That's big. Maybe I think it's a parody just because of how this guy looks. <laughs> I don't know. He just kind of reminds me of like Aaron Paul in Breaking Bad. Like he's out here cooking meth using primitive tools. I don't know what the fuck we're watching, man. It's like, it's always sunny and primitive technology here. <laughs> this is pretty fucking good, man. This guy's dressed like a fucking riot control officer back in like the biblical era. Fucking got body armor on and a little fucking bow and shit. This guy probably actually lives out here too. Like he's committed to like five times as hard as primitive technology. Oh, this is where he makes those shoes he was wearing. I think the reason why this looks so much like a parody is because he's marching around like he fucking hates every second of it. God damn it! I just want to- see, I just want some fucking YouTube views, damn it! Damn you, primitive technology, you motherfucker! I'm literally living out here! Like, honestly, this guy seems better at it than primitive technology. To be fair. Wow! I haven't checked in on primitive technology in a while. Did he make himself a pair of shoes? If he is not wearing those same brand shoes that this guy has made out of leaves and dog shit, then I'm gonna say this guy is better than primitive technology. Where are we at? Has he made the internet yet? He's made a 5G tower. No shoes. Rookie. Rookie! You're nothing compared to survive alone.